What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to a brand new episode of WWE Supercar here on the channel. If you guys enjoy what you see, smash that like button as always. Subscribe to the channel if you have not already for the top notch WWE Supercar content on YouTube. We got some more here coming soon, so stay tuned for that. And we also got the Bray Wyatt event, which will be coming soon. Stay tuned for that. So anyways, we're going to log in. We have some stuff to get, some claim. Now, I was recording my packs for LMS. Unfortunately, all the packs that I got that were recorded were completely shit. And I mean completely shit. I probably got... I don't even think I got one Cataclysm in my recorded pack. I don't think I did. I did get like a total of seven or eight Cataclysms. But three of them were superstars that I did not record. Three of them were enhancements, so I'm not going to waste your time. And then two of them were also not recorded, but they were supports. But they were supports that didn't mean shit to me. So, honestly, I'm not going to post that up, wasting your guys' time. I respect you guys' time and value, so I'm not going to post my LMS packs. They were honestly completely horrendous for what I got, as record-wise. Uh, but we got... Claim phase, we do have to show you the Team Road to Glory. I'm sorry that it shows the old Road to Glory. But until you close out the game entirely, entirely on Blue Stacks, it doesn't update. But you still, you still will see the cards. I uh, got a Summer Fusion. I probably got, a, I think I got one TBG pack to open up. So yeah, we got some decent stuff today. So guys, smash the like button. Let's get started. First things first, I'm going to start with is, of course, the Team Road to Glory. Now this Road to Glory is just all amazing cards. It's amazing. We got a throwback Jerry Lar for the Titan. We got Ric Flair Hall of Fame for the 34. Goliath John Cena throwback. Awesome. I feel like they give out Mark Henry all the time though. It's kind of unfortunate we got this one, but eh. All right, Mark Henry SummerSlam. King Booker, pretty decent card. Like it. Uh, we got a Lunge Blaze. Not bad. You know, not bad. Uh, Card angle, I'll take it. Not a bad image at all. Probably the blue's gonna kill the outline if you ever want to use it for like another image. But overall, nice image. This is the one everyone's more excited about than the, than the Cataclysm card. People are like, oh my god, they threw in the Rob Schamberger Triple H WrestleMania 35 card. I like it. It's gonna be a new image. I could get to keep it now, so awesome. And then of course we got Stone Cold Steve Austin. So yeah, uh, a really really good good event. I like it. Really sweet. Everyone's more excited for this card than this card, though, which is throwing me off a little bit. Like, yeah, don't get me wrong, this card's amazing. But then I guess you could say, like, oh, this has more sentimental value because you could use the pictures more than this card's only going to be useless once this tier ends. So I see everyone's logic. I could see it. I'm not going to argue it. Now we're going to actually get into our TBG pack. I'll do that next. So let's get into it. TBG time. Let's do it. All right. Uh, champion awards. Can we get a Cataclysm? Can we get a Stone Cold Steve Austin? Even though it's already a pro for me. Boom! No, we get the worst fucking pack in the world. Uh, this is probably going to be shit. Let's see. Uh, we got all males in that pack. Oh, okay, three males. That's awesome. Well, so we'll do LMS last, of course. Next up, we're going to do our Fusion. Enjoy the ride. Now, we only got two and a half days left for this. I still need that fourth Carmella. I'm dying for that fourth Carmella. I got four WrestleManias in a row. Uh, I did record a couple of these, but all have been WrestleManias. This one, I hope, this one's going to go up because this, this is totally unedited. This one's going to go up no matter what it is, a WrestleMania or a Cataclysm. I'm hoping to get that Carmella. If not, give me Shawn Michaels to give me my up arrow and I can complete the whole Giants deck. Uh, I'm not going to look at the card. We'll see what we get. Hopefully, it's something good. Uh, Carmella, please. That would be fantastic. Please be Carmella. I need to see some titties. All right. We still got to get some more popcorn, but that shouldn't be too hard of a thing. Uh, we did not get Carmella. I, I already know that for a fact. Did we get another WrestleMania for the fifth time in a row? Because this has just been horrible for me now. And, oh, my effing God. All right. This is just atrocious. Those packs are not giving out like they uh, used to for me. I got like 22 out of 24. And now it's like I'm 0 and 5 for my last five. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, I, th I guess I'm going on that streak again. But I still got two and a half days. I should be able to get at least another five of those in, I'd probably say. 
Yikes. All right. And now for the finale, we have our amazing LMS Becky Lynch card. Now, I did. I, I am a hypocrite. I told people, y'all should not go hand for this card. And then what do I do? I, I, I got lost in the trend. I got, I got lost in the mix. Told people you shouldn't go ham on this card, and I went ham on this card like a dumbass. But once I saw I was on the last day and I was still in the purple, I'm like, might as well not just get the purple card because fuck that. <laughs> now I'm already in the purple card, and the last day is when it really kicked off. Like, the last day was the worst. First three days were nothing. And, of course, Sunday, everyone, for some reason, has to make your life a living hell. So I'm like, all right. So this card, I was hoping... To get to get it for like around two something million, and unfortunately went to three million and change. So I got rank twenty four again. Every time I get purple, it's always twenty four. That's my favorite number. If I'm gonna finish in the purple, I'm gonna get twenty four, unless I can go higher, of course. But if I'm finishing between twenty one and thirty three, twenty four is the number I'm gonna go for. So we get rank twenty four, Becky Lynch. <laughs> you guys see the trend with the number twenty four. Booyah, number 24, Becky Lynch. So overall, pretty sweet. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get her ass trained up ASAP. Now, her stats are going to be like 1.1 million after all said and done, by the way. And yes, I, you guys did see a fusion. I did claim it, but I didn't record it. It was Chad Gable, but honestly, who cares? Fusions... I just not something people look forward to these days. I, I, I clearly see it. So I'm going to get rid of a WrestleMania card to boost up Becky. Uh, I could just get rid of Fords, to be honest, because he's just so freaking useless of a card. You know, let's get rid of that freaking Bobby Roode, too. I don't want to see any more WrestleMania cards anymore. They annoy me. All right. So we'll go, we'll go Becky. We'll get rid of... Nah, we'll just get rid of, I'll get rid of all these cards, to be honest with you. Just get rid of all. Boom, boom, boom. I don't need Jeff Hardy. Actually, I might need to pro Jeff Hardy, to be honest with you. And there we go. Becky Lynch. One million in every stat. Love it. Uh, once you add the tokens, it's going to be around 20K-ish. 20K, 20K, and this will be about 13.5. So I'm going to keep it basic. Go with the regular stats. Now, when you add momentum on this card, it's going to be 1.9 million. But then once you add the games added, it should be 1.1 million in at least speed and charisma. It might also hit it in toughness, but it might not. Like For me, I don't have like momentum slots right now at all. I got to play war mode, and I haven't been playing anything at all. Because uh, I don't really play King of the Rings right now, so I don't really see the point. Uh, there you guys go. It will probably go be above 1.1 million three stats. So this Becky Lynch is going to be overpowered. No card can touch her. Carmella loses by a hundred something K. There's just no chance any card is going to touch this. Not even a heroic. There's just no card in the world that's going to touch it. Now let's check out Becky's images. Uh, I wonder. Uh, I feel like this one won't be the worst. Not bad. It's just way too glowy, man. Uh, Survivor. It's all right. It's all right. You know what I mean? And then we got the... I love how that one is so centered compared to the other cards. But this one, it's just the blue glow that freaking kills it for me. Uh, I actually don't mind this look. It looks all right, but it's just too small for me. Like I, I like cards that are much bigger. Uh, Becky doesn't look bad with the SummerSlam. A little too glowy, though. Harden, who the hell would want to use this image? I don't even know. Uh, I'm going to skip the blue because I already know the blue ones are crap. I'm not a fan of the zombie images at all. I think they're just bleh. Uh, I'm not a fan of the WrestleMania one at all. Uh, SummerSlam 17 is okay. Decent looking card. Uh, I, I pop, a lot of people like the monster image, and I can see why it actually does match with the, the green. So finally, a monster image that's actually fucking useful. <laughs> uh, Becky probably wouldn't look bad with this one either, but unfortunately, the blue kind of kills it as well. Like, imagine blues. Uh, I'm not. I wasn't the biggest fan of this card to begin with. I don't know, wasn't really a big fan of the image, but it doesn't look that bad on this card. It looks pretty decent. Uh, then we got the regular Goliath, which also doesn't look that bad either. So. Pick your pick whatever you like. Uh, this card looks freaking horrendous on this card. I don't like it at all. 
so screw the fusion version of it uh the neon looks horrible obviously these are the top ones besides the shadow i think the shadow car looks effing disgusting on it but it's, if you choose an image it'll probably be between this one the man which was the event card in wrestlemania 35 tier and then her regular wrestlemania 35 card in general which makes her look like a badass ready to blow a pop off your ass you know what i mean like she about to she about to end your whole virginity look so uh pick your poison uh, I'm gonna go with I don't know which card I'm gonna honestly I'll probably just go with the monster for now yeah just go with that for now but yeah guys so uh, we'll go ahead and claim this one stupid uh, ticket and uh, call that a call that an episode so thank you guys uh, so much for watching as always have fun playing your road to glory teams and uh, don't forget we do have uh, the Bray Wyatt thing coming out which I'm gonna show on your screen if you guys have been living under a rock, I'm sure all of you already know about it. So, like I said, next coming Thursday, we got this Thursday. We have the double Bray Wyatt event, <laughs> the Yowie Wowie. Uh, we got the Fun House Bray, and then we got the sexy, most gorgeous Fiend Bray. I love it. I love it. So, uh, I'm not sure how they're going to do this. I honestly hope what they do... I feel like it's going to be a Road to Glory ring domination. That is my opinion. I don't think they're going to do a Giants Unleashed fast one because it honestly will be a little a little hard if they don't make the points reasonable because remember, everyone's going to be attacking and those Giants will go down ex just fast. So unless the points are really cut in like half, Giants Unleashed, it, it could be extremely, extremely bad. But I tell you right now, Supercar is going to give you one event that you're going to hate. And you're going to have to deal with it completely. That's the rules. That, that's Supercar. You want Giants Unleashed? You're going to get a Road to Glory. You want Ring Domination? You're going to get a Road to Glory. Either way, you guys are going to get a Road to freaking Glory. Supercar is not that generous. I've learned that for the past five years. They're not as generous as you think. So you're going to get a road to glory for everyone who's, who's going to question it. You're going to get a road to glory. Mark my words on that. If I'm wrong, uh, I'll delete a catacles on pro for you guys on the screen. 100%. I don't mind. <laughs> Fuck it. So, yeah. But what I do want to know is, are they both going to be heroics? So once you finish it, you see two heroic upgrades. That is what I want to see. I Because I, if they make that Bray Wyatt on the fun, uh, the Firefly Funhouse, if it's just a regular type money in the bank card, I'm going to be extremely disappointed. I would love that card to be a heroic. It would make the most sense to make it a heroic as well. So I'm hoping both these cards are going to be heroics. Uh, obviously, the Fiend will be a heroic. But make that other Bray Wyatt a heroic. I want to see two heroic upgrades on the heroic side. And it just makes the most sense. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed today's video, smash the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you have not already. It will be live again for the Yowie Wowie streams, as always. Sorry I couldn't stream much over the weekend and stuff, but things happen. All right, guys. I love you guys. See you next time. Peace out. Have a good road to glory. And I'll see you on the next episode. Take care. God bless. And uh, cheerios.